Hey guys, it's Sax Productions 101 here with my next deck review. These are the Multi Miller Gargoyles Label Expo decks. It's basically the prototype deck to the Gargoyle deck that was designed by Lance Miller and helped produce by Steve Rooks. Um, so let's check out this deck and I'll show you some of my feelings about this deck. I'm not really going to do any rating because this, as you will see, once we get into the deck review more, that this is not a deck you would use on a normal basis. But we're just going to check it out and look at the specs of this deck. And just let me tell you a little bit about this deck. So, as I said before, this is the prototype deck to the Gargoyles deck that Lance Miller designed. He told me it took over 80 hours of drawing work. He hand drew these cards to produce this deck of cards which is awesome and it shows that he put in a lot of detail work and thought into this deck which makes it the awesome design deck a work of art that it is so let's check it out now this is a box out of the package and this is a box in the package it is a wrap around cover it's not cellophane it's like hard plastic and at the top it says label expo 2010 it has the gargoyle little symbol here, the symbol that's on the Ace of Spades right there in the middle, and it's signed by Lance Miller himself there, and it says Multi Miller Gargoyles, and it has this awesome background design behind all of this, which continues throughout the entire package. On the back, you just have some sponsors that helped, I'm assuming, create the deck, and I this is one I will not take out of the of the plastic because it just, I mean, it looks awesome in the plastic itself and I have one already out of the plastic here so if we check it out we'll check at the top it says limited edition playing cards you see the gargoyle and the insignia right there that's in the ace of spades the multi miller gargoyles just like um, the deck that's in the cellophane or plastic rather on the side it says multi miller illustrations and on the other side it says the exact same thing on the bottom it says multi miller playing cards and then it has a uh, barcode thingamajigger that you can take a picture of with your phone and it will take, it, take you right to his website and there's his website right there down at the bottom lancetmiller.com it will be in the description box down there also and if we check out the back it's the gargoyle's back design yet it is very much darker and the actual cards that were produced. On the top it says Gargoyles Limited Edition and Poker. So let's open this deck. So it's actually really hard to get all the cards out at one time. I did really good with that draw out. And as you can see the cards are really 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 dark. And if you actually own a deck of Gargoyles you know that the Gargoyle actual the actual one that was produced and was sent to you guys is much lighter than this. It's the same exact back design yet much much lighter. And if you look as I'm just going through the cards as so, you probably can tell this is not a deck you would use because it's kinda sucky. I don't want to say that just because it's a expo deck, it's the prototype, it wasn't gonna be the one that was manufactured and released. It was just a couple a copies of it were made so that people, collectors, etc., could have a deck of cards um, that was meaningful and it was a collector's item to them. But these cards are actually really, really thin. If you look at them and if you were to take a deck of cards and just like shake it, a normal deck of cards would not do that and would not give you that that noise. If you can hear that noise a deck of cards. Normal bicycle would not do that. So let's check out these cards down here. This is basically just information about the deck itself and it's worth reading because I have read it and it's basically just describing the deck to you and whatnot and telling you what it's about and what he put into it to make it and etc. things like that. You have the two Jokers, um, again, the Jokers are much darker than the actual Jokers are produced. The Jokers on 
the actual manufactured and sent out deck um, are almost silver and they're much lighter than what this is. And if you look at the pips and everything on this deck, they are silver in the actual gargoyle deck and the court cards are also silver and black and is nothing like the coloring of the expo deck. Um, if you look here, the Ace of Spades is the same, but again, it is much darker, along with the pips on the sides. It's much, much darker in this deck than in the actual manufactured deck. But at the same time, this is a deck that's worth having just because it's, it's a sentimental collector's item that pays tribute to the Gargoyle deck that got released and sent out to everyone that bought it. So thank you guys for watching. I hope this was informative and I hope you enjoyed this. Um, if you would like a deck of these cards, I would look on eBay because um, Mr. Miller Lance sold out of them. Uh, he only made so many of them and they are truly a collector's item. So I would go check on eBay. Just type in Multi Miller Gargoyles or whatever I have in the title up above. So thank you guys for watching and comment, rate, and subscribe and look for more videos coming soon.